हेलो एवरीवन आई एम डॉक्टर आर एम डी पीडियाट्रिक रेसिडेंट एट पी एंड डॉक्टर आर एम एल हॉस्पिटल न्यू डेली एंड दिस इज़ द पार्ट फाइव ऑफ डीबंकिंग द मिथ सीरीज वेर विल बी डिस्कसिंग आई एन आई पी वे प्रीवियस ईयर क्वेश्चन एनालिसिस ऑफ सर्जरी एंड देन विल बी अप्लाइंग इट फॉर रिविजन स्ट्रैटेजी फॉर द अपकमिंग्स आई एन आई सी टी द टाइटल इज डोंट स्टडी सर्जरी एंड आई विल बी टेलिंग यू इन दिस वीडियो वाई यू शूडेंट स्टडी सर्जरी इन मच डेप्थ फॉर दिस अपकमिंग आई एन आई सी टी सो वेन आई प्लॉटेड द डेटा ऑफ सर्जरी Uh, according to recall questions uh, from past seven INICT question papers, what I found was very intriguing that no single topic has a majority uphold. Okay, topics like GIT, where thirty nine questions have been asked out of one seventeen, but then GIT is a very vast topic. It converts it. It consists of whole GI tract, liver, and uh, also pancreas, spleen. So it's very big topic, and it is difficult to uh, study within a short span of time. Also, so definitely will uh, expect a lot more questions from that. But then from Other topics also like general surgery, twenty four questions were asked, and rest of the topics few questions were asked. So majority the chunk of the questions were from GIT and general uh, surgery. But then again, general surgery is also a very broad topic. But one important thing which I noted was this breast. Breast is a small topic and consisted of eleven questions. Eleven questions were asked from asked from breast alone. Okay, and that to breast carcinoma only or breast lump evaluation of breast lump. Okay, euro which is bigger topic than breast contained only nine questions and it has been inconsistent also. See, there were few years where zero questions were asked, but breast consistently one or two questions have been asked. So two topics which are very consistent throughout were one was GIT, the other was breast. These two topics one or the other question will definitely be asked every year. so these two topics you shouldn't be missing out because that definitely will come this year also okay so here itself i divided the uh, uh, questions according to case based questions and image based questions and in this i found that uh, case based questions majority are asked from breast almost 50 questions asked from breast carcinoma are based on cases only means they will be given case scenario and uh, like the staging of the tumor and then you have to uh, tell what is the next step of management such questions are asked okay and very important ctvs where i have combined heart and vascular system okay this vascular system has majority of questions are especially especially varicose veins and peripheral artery disease and out of those seven questions asked so far Uh, sorry uh, out of those seven questions asked so far six questions were case based only so when you are studying peripheral artery disease or varicose veins uh, this venous system so lymphatic system make sure that you study clinical based questions only for images surgery five instrument questions were asked instrument image based questions were asked and totally seven instrument questions were asked in the past seven years so you can expect in instrument based image questions also okay and then general surgery images were asked seven times Okay, rest of the system don't show much consistency. Like endo, here and there, it may come or may not come. Again, euro also same. Two years no questions were asked. This year you might expect a question. Okay, trauma again. Uh, last year there were no questions from trauma. So this again is a uh, controversial topic. So, but trauma since it is small topic and in one year four questions were asked, another year three questions were asked. So you should definitely read trauma. It's not a big topic. And I also suggest to go and read trauma from Q Bank also because Q Bank solving. Uh, Cubic model of trauma is very important so that you get to know the clinical case scenarios and how to solve these questions. So, what is the INICT trend for surgery in the last few years? It is very shocking, and this was the reason why I told don't give much importance to surgery this year because it is in a falling trend. Okay, from twenty six twenty twenty six questions, not twenty ah yeah twenty six questions in twenty twenty November, it has fallen to twelve questions in the last INICT. Twenty six to twelve, so much fifty percent decline. Okay. Not fifty, two hundred percent decline. Sorry. Okay. So this this pattern, um, I don't know whether it will persist, but based on my all subject analysis, none of the subjects have gone from this uh, this uh, uh, valley to a peak. It won't happen that tomorrow surgery twenty five or thirty questions will be asked. It is not going to happen. In none of the INS it has happened. If it has reached the uh, valley, it has reached the lowermost point. then it might come up to 15 or 16 in the next exam it won't go above 25 okay so that's why i told compared to other subject give less import uh, compared to those other uh, five subjects which are in top 100 which are century subjects give uh, less importance to surgery among them because for 12 questions it is not worth sacrificing so much of time okay you have other subjects to study also okay then topic wise if you come this general surgery part this trauma GIT and this breast. This will cover almost seventy percent of the topics. So these are the four systems you should 
uh, focus your attention on so that you don't twist them and GIT also I tell you what to study okay so topic wise in trauma uh, so these are the most frequent clash okay so instead of making this topics subject wise which are very instead of making it subject wise which topics are very frequently asked uh, or sorry topic wise which topics are very frequent clash I made this uh, as the most important questions overall okay so overall trauma had the most important question most number of questions that is four questions and breast carcinoma had four questions pneumoperitoneum has been asked three times continuously colorectal carcinoma and breast carcinoma again have been asked so if you uh, mix up these from breast itself you are getting seven questions just on uh, surgical management and immunohistochemistry and molecular test that means every year one question will be asked from breast carcinoma so don't miss this topic then coming to less frequently asked questions all these questions make a note of all these questions these are the repeated questions okay so this these questions along with these questions will make up the chunk so if you're not able to suppose you have two days to study surgery and you're not able to study surgery in two days what to do is go through these topics only in your notes or videos or whatever you are using go to these topics in depth so that these questions will definitely be asked and in the upcoming top uh, upcoming uh, surgery exam also okay in the upcoming inct exam uh, total around we are expecting surgery questions to be around uh, uh, 12 to 15 okay 12 to 15 questions will be asked and out of that whatever i had given now from these important questions from these important questions at least six to seven questions will definitely be asked six to seven questions will be from this one okay no doubt in that and uh, upon that breast carcinoma will be having two or three questions and then uh, uh, this uh, uh, trauma will be having one or two questions okay GIT I told you say from this whatever comes under GIT you study under GIT okay so what are the most uh, take home messages for the revision strategy so most consistent is GIT so GIT and breast these are the most consistent topics okay so this you have to study okay and don't study everything if you don't have time i have already told you in the previous slide this one what you have to study okay these two slides will tell you what you have to study then breast and instruments are also equally important because less time to complete this and you'll get more in return general surgery images are important seven images have been asked so far that means one image per question paper so expect a question image based question from general surgery and how you have to go you have to go through breast instruments trauma general surgery and important gate of it this is the order that you have to follow okay if you follow this order you will cover surgery in a short duration time of time and you will be getting more in output also okay so this was the surgery uh, surgery pyq analysis and revision strategy so next we'll be discussing medicine okay everyone is very eager for this topic okay we'll be discussing medicine in the next video thank you